What's going on YouTube family? My name's Garrett. I'm a seven figure full time Amazon seller. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to use a tool that's called SellerAmp to find profitable products online to flip on Amazon for a profit. Now, if you're new to selling on Amazon or just aren't familiar with the term online arbitrage, online arbitrage works. Basically, we're shopping on, you know, regular websites like Walmart, Target, Bed Bath & Beyond, Kohl's.com, all these big retailers that we all know and hear of, these stores oftentimes run sales, have coupons, and a ton of different things that allows us to find gaps in the marketplace between one retailer compared to Amazon. So we're basically just shopping for products on these websites that we can then find those products at a discount and flip them on Amazon for a profit. So that's essentially how online arbitrage works. Now, the main point of this video is to really show you guys how I personally use SellerAmp and how my students use SellerAmp as a tool to make this process a whole lot more efficient. So you can go out there, hit the ground running, and just be as efficient and fast as possible when learning how to source and find products to flip on Amazon. So without further ado, let's go ahead, hop on into my computer. I'm gonna find some profitable products with you guys, go through kind of what I look for when finding a potential profitable product and how many to order, how fast is this product selling, what's the profit margin, what's the average sales price of this product. We're gonna go through all of that in this video, so make sure you're taking notes and making sure you're watching till the end of the video. Let's go ahead and hop on into my computer. All righty guys, we are inside of my computer. We are gonna be checking out bathandbodyworks.com. This is a website I like to source often due to that they have a lot of sales a lot of times. Sometimes they'll have general sales, 50, 75% off like this on just random items. Sometimes they'll do a specific product line where they're doing deep discounts. Um, and it's just a great website. They never cancel orders on me. Um, I've put in like, I've ordered 600 units of a single item before, back-to-back -back orders, 20, 30 unit orders, never got canceled. So that is why I like sourcing Bath & Body Works. So let's go ahead and see what type of sales they're running. We see that they're doing 50 to 75 off off select sale items. So we're gonna start our search there. And we're really just gonna make our way down this list of products and start checking out some of them. I like opening up, up on a new tab so I don't have to bounce back and forth. Open up SellerAmp here. This is SellerAmp. This is the actual application that I use. It's great because we can search Amazon's website on a different website without having to jump back and forth. So this is a Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Shower Gel. Um, we see it's going for 395. They have it right here, 219,000 rank. I'm not liking the ranking on this. So we're gonna go ahead and pass and keep it moving. What do we have here? Stress and Relief Candle. Let's go ahead and check out this right here. Smoked old fashioned shower gel. Let's see if this is on Amazon. This is a big discount, guys. $15.50 down to $3.95. We have bourbon. Um, not seeing it there, so I'm going to keep it moving. Let's keep going here, guys. <clears throat> I like the shower gels and stuff a lot of times, just for one reason or another. I don't know why. If you're going to get into the candles, you're going to have to use, involve bubble wrap and stuff, and I just don't like doing that. But there's a lot of money in selling glass stuff because there's that barrier to entry where some people just aren't willing to do it. So watch this, guys. Let's check out these Wallflower Fragrance Refills, okay? They're going for $350. And we see right here, this is the Rose Water and Ivy. This is the Rose Water and Ivy. Okay, so that's a four-pack. I don't know if this is going to be profitable. 12, it'll be 14 bucks. And if we use seller amp, we are going to determine if this is going to be profitable or not. $14, it is not going to be profitable. This is just because I have my prep center fees and shipping fees all built into here. So for me, this might, this isn't profitable. You might be able to make a buck or two on it. Not really worth my time. Um, we'd have to get it for cheaper than that. So we're going to keep it pushing. Is this a wallflower? We have eucalyptus mint. Let's keep it pushing here, guys. Ooh, what is this? Cotton candy clouds, limited edition, guys. A lot of times these limited edition ones too can make good money. Cotton candy champagne, that's not gonna do it. Let's keep it pushing. 
Okay, we have these different fragrances. Let's check out some more of these wallflowers, guys, because I've sold a lot of wallflowers in the past, believe it or not, and I'll kind of show you guys a little thing here as well. Great thing we want to look for too is not just looking for the actual scent, right? As we can see right here, this is a Bath & Body Works six pack um, sampler, right? So what does that mean? It means pretty much you can order six different random wallflowers and let's see if this one's actually getting six specific ones or if it's just a random assortment. Six, power, six different scents, assorted colors. Okay, so guys, this is a listing where you could order six of these different f scents of wallflowers, right, and put them in a bundle, guys. So if you're new to Amazon, you can bundle products like maybe a shampoo and a conditioner, as we can see on this listing here. This is just a random variety pack of six different scents, right? And the great thing about this listing is it's not six specific scents. It just says six different colors, not a specific scent. So we can go on here and find six different colors and six different scents of this for 350. So six times 350, let's see, let's go ahead and pull out our calculator. I don't think it's gonna be profitable, but for the sake of this video, that's 21 bucks, right? I can already tell you we're not gonna make money on that, but that's just an option you guys can look out for as well. I can tell you people aren't gonna be buying it for that much, so that's nothing there. Let's keep it moving. Waikiki Beach Coconut Cream. Let's see if this is going to be a hitter. I think I've sold this one before. Waikiki Beach Coconut Cream, that's too high of a rank. Waikiki Beach Coconut Ultra Shea Body Cream. Okay, it's a different packaging, but I've sold, it's the same scent, but Bath & Body Works is known to change their packaging quite often, believe it or not. Um, and I've sold it and never had a problem. It depends if you wanna take that risk or not. So let's just go ahead and look at this product right here. Waikiki Beach Coconut Ultra Shea Body Cream, eight ounces. Waikiki Beach Ultimate Hydration Body Cream, eight ounces. So this looks like the same exact product. It is a 24 hour moisture, essential oil. So everything looks the same, all right? Ultra Shea Body Cream, just double checking. Ultimate Hydration Body Cream. So this appears to be the same product. It is a riskier product, but let's say you're willing to take that risk on this. We're gonna be paying seven bucks for this and it's selling for $22.73. So at $7, even with my prep center costs and taxes and stuff like that, even though I'm sending it to a tax-free uh, state, so that's not gonna, I don't know why I just said that anyways, but $22.72 sale price, we're making a $6 profit, a 95% ROI, and this thing sells about 710 times a month as a two-pack, right? And there's a one-pack, and we could go ahead, and what we wanna do, since this is a variation listing, we wanna go down to variations here on Keepa. And we can see this is the two pack guys. What I like to do to see like how much this specific product on this variation listing, it, how many sales it's getting is by looking at the overall rating percentage. So it looks like it has about 13% of the overall ratings on this listing. So we can assume that it's selling roughly 13% of those 710 sales per month. So this is probably real, realistically selling around 90 times per month. So if you're a new Amazon seller, you'd be like, holy crap, 710 sales per month. I'm gonna order 500 of them, right? But th this specific variation on this listing is only getting about 13% of the sales, which still isn't bad, 90 sales a month. What we wanna do is see how many competitive sellers there are, meaning how many FBA sellers are within that same price range. So we have, we wanna filter out and go prime only, cause that's gonna be our competition. 2273, and then we can see that the next price after that is $25.99. So there's only one competitive seller at this price. So if it's selling 90, we could assume we're gonna sell 45 in a month, maybe a little more, maybe a little less. So we could order, you know, 100 of these and send in 52 packs at $7 profit. That's $350 profit just on this one product. So not bad, I would definitely take the risk on this product just because I've done it before, I have a seasoned account, it's just different packaging, it's the same exact product, and a lot of the customers know, but you will have that customer every now and then that complains, oh, this is a knockoff, this is this, this is that. As long as you have your documentation of your receipt, you can submit to Amazon that you purchased these products from Bath & Body Works. 
you're good to go. I don't know why people are so scared of getting inauthentic complaints these days because it's an easy breeze walk in the park dealing with them if you just know what you're doing. But that is essentially one product we could get right there. Um, 350 bucks profit, just like that. Let's go ahead and check out some more. I'm looking for these really low priced ones because this just isn't gonna be a big enough discount knowing my experience selling from Bath & Body Works. We need these deeply discounted ones to make it work. Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower. I think I've sold this one too in the past. Yep. Body cream, eight ounces. Ultra hydration body cream, eight ounces. Okay. 8K rank. We have another winner right here, guys. I actually might order these because I've sold these before. But this is a big variation listing. But I'm telling you, it's getting thousands of sales a month based off of these reviews. Again, 1,400 sales per month. We're paying seven bucks for this. Even with my prep center cost, I'm gonna make 463, 66% ROI. We're gonna go ahead and check Keepa for the variations, find this specific variation. And we're gonna see you know, what, what percentage of sales this thing is getting across. Because we have a bunch of different flavors on here and some of them are two packs, some of them are three packs. So here we go right here. This is not getting many percentage of sales of this overall listing and it seems like people have been in stock on this specific one for quite a while so this is something i would consider probably not buying just due to the fact i don't see a lot of sales happening we just see the seller count going up and up and up and not really dropping back off the price has been very consistent it's just of the overall list there's not enough volume on this listing with this much variations and that low of a review count overall to make sense buying but if it was that would be a great find because it'd be a nice roi so let's keep it pushing here coconut breeze what is that right there i'm looking for these low priced ones just skimming through here what can we find here guys come on let's find something else for you guys Ooh, what was that that's a popular scent if I remember myself. And a lot of times guys, like these little two, $3 profit products at the end of the day, like if you're doing volume, if you sell 3000 of them a month, you got 10 grand profit just on these lower profit products. Hire someone to prep them for you and you're good to go. All right, 362 saltwater breeze shower gel. No freaking way, is this it right here? There's a lot of good stuff on Bath & Body Works right now. I might have to purchase some of this stuff and post this video after. Okay, so this thing is cranking, right? 10 fluid ounces, is this a 10 fluid ounce? 10 fluid ounces, salt water breeze shower gel. Okay, but there's a lot of different scents. This is a big variation listing as well, but let's just see if we're profitable at four bucks about. So we're profitable at 386, selling for 1650. Lowest FBA seller, 1695. Type that in on seller amp. So we're making over 100% ROI on this product. Let's go to Saltwater Breeze, 10 fluid ounces variation. Be this one right here. We can see this has 239 ratings. It's 1% of the overall ratings, but I can guarantee you this is selling. Side so order, you know, 30 of them. Just because it's so cheap, it's a great ROI, 106% ROI. I guarantee you this would sell, but it just looks like a uh, 239 ratings is quite a bit. It doesn't look like it's been moving lately. Let's see why that is. Okay, we can see this product look like it's been in stock and the ranking just came back in year. We can see it definitely does sell though. You can see, you can kind of see when these Bath and Body Works sales happens because we went from 11 offers all the way up to 37, um, and the price dropped down to 1301. So even at 1301, we probably wouldn't be profitable. Would we'd barely be profitable at 1301? Um, but my strategy, kind of, a lot with a lot of this stuff, is I go wide on these sales, and some hit, some don't. It's just how it works. But it's always great to use Keepa to check, you know, the variation the price volatility. This product has been very stable for the past, what has it been? Since January, above 1465. So you'd still be making a couple bucks. But as we can see, once this spikes back up, the price really tanks on these. So I wouldn't go deep on this. I'd probably just order 30, see what happens. 
Worst case, I'm probably gonna be able to get out of there with a worst 22% ROI. So this is kind of how I use Selleramp and kind of paired with Keepa. Keepa and Selleramp together is probably gonna run you 35 bucks a month. Can't beat it, can't go wrong. These two tools provide you with so much data. And again, I have Selleramp linked down in the description for you guys to make it easy. You can also see Keepa over here on Selleramp and there's just a bunch of different other stuff. You can see all the different offers, so on and so forth. And we can hop around to people's storefronts and things like that. But once I'd go from here is once I'm done checking out Bath and Body Works website, I'd start checking out some of these other sellers on this listing, especially the ones that look like they have a little bit more ratings and are deeper on products. That probably means they're doing a lot of online arbitrage. So I'd go like right here, 21 stock. This guy has 40 and we know these guys are not buying these wholesale. So we know they're doing online arbitrage. We're gonna go to their storefront. They have 607 offers. As you can see, Bath and Body Works sets candles, different toys. This guy sells a lot of Bath & Body Works. Let's just see how much Bath & Body Works he sells. He has 441 listings of just Bath & Body Works. So over half of his listings are just Bath & Body Works products because they run a lot of sales, guys, believe it or not. You just have to be kind of crafty with how you purchase stuff. Let's see how many reviews he's gotten in the last month. Nine feedback. So he's probably selling, I'd probably say he's probably selling for 3,500 to 4,000 units a month just from the storefront, which isn't bad. If you're making three bucks profit, this guy's definitely make, clearing six figures profit per year. So that is how you use Selleramp paired with different online retail websites to find products that we could flip on Amazon. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. It was awesome. I had a great time making this video it's for you guys. Pretty much the only tool I use when selling on Amazon is Selleramp. So it's very, very cost effective. It's affordable. And great thing is guys, they have a mobile app now. So when you're out there doing retail arbitrage, which is the same concept, but you're actually going to the store, you can use Selleramp in the store now, which is a huge game changer. So there's just a lot more data compared to the other applications out there that have been available, available to us Amazon sellers in the past. So definitely check out Selleramp. I have an affiliate link down in the description. Make sure to check that out. And if you want to take your Amazon selling game to the next level, go ahead and check out the Arbitrage University link in my description. It's my Amazon selling training program, taking you from A to Z, how to start, grow, and scale a profitable business on Amazon. I also have a free training that I host every single Sunday, link down in the description as well. So hopefully I will see you there. But without further ado, guys, that's gonna wrap it up for this one. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comment section below and I'll see you guys on the next video.